Alright, so the first thing the first thing you gotta do is make sure you have an image, make sure you know where it is and what it's called. I find that uh, JPEG formats work the best. JPG or bitmap is also good, another good one, BMP. So after you have your picture, you wanna start up Photoshop. Open up your image. And you go into filter, render, lens flare. There is many different kinds of lens flare you can add. My favorite being the, the 105 millimeter prime. And you just want to take this little crosshair and place it where you want the light to be coming from. Well, that's about good. So there's one of them. And then for the next light, we take it and we just click back over there. That looks about good. Alright. Now we want to save this. Uh, make sure you don't save it as the same as the original file. Because you'll need both of them. I need nine car lights to indicate that as the one with the lights. Uh, make sure you save it as the highest settings, you know, quality 12, maximum. And, um, and okay. Uh, make sure it's saved. Right there. Now close out of Photoshop, and now uh, you want to start up Image Ready. Uh, there's one thing I forgot to do. You want to take both of those images and throw them into the same folder. You can just call it Car, but just make sure they're in their own separate little folder right there. Alright, so now we go into uh, image ready, go import, folder as frames, and there's car, and there they are. Uh, let's see, that's eh, a bit fast. Um, let's put that on a 0.5 second delay, that should be better. And maybe not that about point three five. Mm. Eh, whatever. That's good enough. So there we have that all set up. You you can fiddle with those all you want. And then we go saved optimized as Make sure it is set as a .gif. Name it whatever you want. I'll just call it car. Make sure it saves to the desktop. And it is right there. And there you have your little happy GIF file. Enjoy.